So, there were new spoilers for Boruto episode 16, okay, and thanks to Ken Zairo, you know, who translated the summaries, I can actually show it to you guys. So, let's read what it says. It says, episode 16, crisis of failing the class. Want to be a ninja alongside everyone. Students are preparing for the fast approaching periodic exams. Depending on the results, it is possible that students may have to repeat class. Thank you, who is not good at climbing, is in trouble and pushes for some extra training, but then obviously something happens and you know maybe this is like an obstacle that Denki needs to overcome obviously I mean this episode is really really predictable and the thing is that you know we don't see Denki after Boruto the movie you know what I'm saying and anywhere in between not even in the manga so definitely something has happened to Denki Iwabe and even the class rep and um, Namida and Wasabi okay so these characters are characters that we don't see before the movie in the manga and also in the movie itself so it says Denki wishes to graduate from the academy alongside Boruto and the rest so he tries to go for special training but he trains recklessly and fears of repeating the class definitely Denki is not good at ninjutsu so I don't really see him passing anything because he just got into ninjutsu you know what i'm saying i mean his father has a ninja background but denki knows absolutely nothing about ninjutsu until he started attending the academy so i don't really think that denki is going to pass maybe he might you know with some special training after all you know boruto is about you know using your strength and you know surpassing your limits and all that kind of stuff so i think maybe they will use that motto here and boruto will once again succeed in helping another classmate overcome their hardships in life and then we have struggling with the books iwabe is at the top of the school when it comes to ninjutsu but he is no good with textbooks boruto joins him to help him study but makes things even more confusing so definitely this proves that boruto is not such a good teacher as he thinks he is and maybe it could also be that iwabe is really just not smart so i think what boruto will do here is that he will use the shadow clone jutsu and you know help denki and iwabi out at the same time maybe that is what he's gonna do i mean if you want to teach two people at the same time that is what you're gonna do when you have a technique which multiplies you so it says periodic exams are here what are the chances of denki failing <laughs> well if it were up to me they are really really high when it comes to iwabi he already has ninjutsu down so he has one thing down right and pretty much denki probably has the studying down because you know he's like a um technician or something he's a smart ass right denki's a smart ass so you know iwabi and denki have opposite struggles pretty much and that is everything for the spoilers and we also have a shot here of metal lee maybe metal lee is gonna join in and help denki use ninjutsu or something that would be like a special surprise you know to expect also for some of the spoilers which came out for the upcoming episodes there was one in there which you know sarada goes to give a patient you know a doll or something and apparently she leaves it in the thunder car now the thing you should know is that sakura actually works in the corner hospital now the thing about sakura is she opened a clinic like a mini clinic inside the corner hospital to help all these kids who lost their parents within the fourth ninja war right and maybe it advanced from there and sakura pretty much you know commands the entire hospital so sakura worked in the hospital and maybe sarada got like a doll you know to give one of the patients there and she just forgot it in the thunder car people are saying it is himawari but himawari you know gets sick the next episode so you know that does not make sense anyways let's get on with you know a little bit of analysis of the ending now in the ending we can see that naruto still gets to keep his you know original biju mode transformation it looks like the sixth class sage mode is gone like i said in my things you missed or something like that because remember when the tail beasts were within him right that is when he unlocked his sixth class sage mode but now the tail beasts are gone so maybe if he wants to unlock it again all he has to do is call out to all these tail beasts to meet inside him right and then he can absorb the chakra and initiate the mode again except from that i think he is just back to 100 percent kurama till beast mode okay also we have this part here you know of sarada and karin obviously they look alike and they have their glasses right now let me explain something right here okay now with sarada and karin people think they are related and i have had a lot of comments in my videos talking or trying to correct me that sarada is actually karin's daughter which is not true at all and you know all i will advise you is 
whoever gave you that information is misinforming you so either change whoever is giving you the information or at least try and you know research the information that you get from people yourselves even if i give you information still research it and double check for yourself because you know no one is perfect including me i could make mistakes you never know so you know yeah um you might want to check that for yourself and also we have this um shot here of all these parents and their kids right and then we have sarada and all that kind of stuff and we have metal lee right and his only parent is his dad which is rock lee maybe they are not going to introduce the mother of metal lee they might probably do that as a tease or something but you know maybe uh, metal lee could be an adopted kid for, for rock lee you never know i mean there were lots of kids out there who lost their parents during the war so maybe rock lee adopted metal lee and you know changed his haircut and you know adjusted the kid to fit his needs or to fit his look so people don't criticize anyways and then we have the short hair of sarada and as you can see sarada is definitely wearing her outfit from naruto gaiden the manga you know what i'm saying so every single person here is gonna have the design from naruto gaiden okay so sarada is getting an outfit change and then in this shot here we can see all the uchiha shin now they have pale skin just like danzo's arm because for those who do not know danzo's arm with the sharingan on it actually originally belonged to uchiha shin for those that don't know so uchiha shin will have that arm replaced and he created a lot of clones so he can use them to replace his body parts which is really really evil so i'm really excited to see you know um, Sasuke's interaction with Sakura because he has been really really blunt and yeah and my thing is that I put a image there of Sakura being animated in um, Naruto Gaiden so uh, this is for episode 19 which is coming up really really soon so you know with that being said that has been my short but quick analysis of the episode previous what i'm planning for my subscribers is i'm planning on creating discussion topics in which i feature at least three subscribers and not more because i'm trying to keep it short and there will be a lot of people who will have a lot to say so maybe like two minutes of talking each you know or expressing opinions will do just as fine so go ahead and join my discord and whenever i have a discussion topic to talk about i will let you guys know and i will pick three people within the discord and you get to be on my video and talk with me and all that good stuff with that being said that has been my video if it entertained you hit the like button subscribe and you know share your opinions in the comment section down below with that being said enjoy the videos at the end and i have nothing more to say bye